was applying for schools, I really didn't know what I wanted to do, and my dad just kind of told me to apply for civil engineering because it's easier to start in engineering than to try to get into it later. I didn't actually know what it was, but then when I actually decided that engineering was where I needed to be was about my sophomore year of college when I started having nerd moments every time I would see a building or bridge and know what forces were canceling out in order to have that standing. So one of the big challenges in engineering is that there is so much in the, in the area of prerequisites, particularly in the pure sciences. So they're taking a lot of chemistry, they're taking a lot of physics, they're taking a lot of mathematics. And very much for the first two years, they're seeing very little of what an engineer actually does. So if they can get out in the field, it's often less about the work that they're actually doing and just meeting other engineers. I know for myself, and when we're doing career advising here on campus, we tell them that when they're in the internship or the co-op, it's really about looking around and finding that person who's doing what you could be passionate about, which you could get excited about five years and ten years out of school. My internship with MWH was a really interesting experience. I was able to do a three-stage uh, lesson with it. The first stage I was working with the Water Resources Division in the Sacramento office. The second stage was doing uh, field work in Yellow Pine, Idaho, which is a very small town. And the last uh, stage was working with the Fort Collins office, also working with the Water Resources Division. MWH has a really great culture that really involves their interns, which was absolutely amazing. I got involved with the Young Professionals Group, which was a great way to have mentors uh, and to feel connected to the culture. The advantages for students' future are going to be around the ability for them to build a strong resume. In engineering, employers look for students who have actually done project work. They have applied the classroom knowledge to some sort of an engineering project. Um, it also it, it allows them to build a professional network um, and to learn about the company cultures and find out what's really the best fit for them when they go to make a permanent job decision. I really appreciated the MWH motto of building a better world. That's something that I want to do is to do my piece in society to make the world a better place and why not do it with a company who has that as their motto. My name is Melissa James. I am a civil engineering student at Colorado State University and I did my internship at MWH Global.